Hey, what's going on, YouTubers? This is your boy B again with another up update on how to extract a brutal star from a piece of live rock. Uh, I had made two videos uh, concerning this uh, subject. Uh, one of the videos uh, that uh, the beginning process of how you would go down here and uh, set it up, you know, adjusting your uh, refugium over or your sump or a space infusion to try to lure him out. And another video was posted on where he actually started coming out. So I've been successful. I've been successful in getting him out. You probably can't really see him, but he's up up in that rock. Got a little piece of fish here for him to eat. Can't really see him too good. But uh, he's, he's messing around with that daggone piece of fish. Uh, He's cool down here. Yeah, you know, I'll keep him down. I never intended to kill him. I didn't want to do that. I wanted to keep him. But uh, I want to make a couple of statements concerning brittle stars to people. Uh, brittle stars, they they will eat your shrimp. They will actively hunt your fish at night. They are pretty agile, they move a lot faster than some people think they do. Uh, I had an opportunity to catch him one night and by the time I took the top off the refugium to try to grab him, he was already back in the rock. He moved pretty fast. Uh, I know a lot of people say, well man, they're good for your tank, they're good debris eaters, they feed on debris and all of that's true. But as they get bigger in their desire or food becomes more, the debris doesn't sustain them anymore. And their appetite pushes them to become ravenous. They become predators. And they will actively hunt. If you have shrimp in your tank, they'll hunt your shrimp. And if you have small fish, they'll catch them slipping and eat them. Now, you know, I'm, I'm just telling you what I know. You know, some people uh, have them and they have them in their tanks and I guess no problems are reported. I mean, if you can actively target feed him, I guess that's not going to be much of a problem. But if you can't actively target him and at night you can guarantee he's going to go out and try to take care of stuff itself. So if you got a brittle star and uh, you bored him because uh, somebody at the pet store told you, oh yeah, he'd be nice to clean your debris up. That'll last for a little while, and then you're going to notice uh, shrimp and stuff starting to slowly disappear. And it's because of your brittle star. He's going to be chomping down on them. All right. This is your boy B. And I hope everybody's aquarium is doing well out there, as well as you yourselves. And I'll be dropping more videos uh, a little later. Peace out.